Hello YouTube, welcome to a brand new video. My name is Abuze. It's been a while that I appear in front of the camera because I don't really want to. I always prefer to hide behind the camera. Anyway, here we are. On today's video, I'm going to answer a question that has been more frequent on my DM and comment section and is how do I download my stock images which I've been using on my photo manipulation project in Photoshop. So, on today's video, I'm going to show you guys how you can navigate the internet and get them of very high quality and for free. So without any further ado, let's jump into the video. Alright, here we are. But first, you need to understand the difference between JPG and PNG. For JPG, they are the normal images that you often see, like the images that you exported that have background like this ones and then for png are images that doesn't have background like this we can just simply drag and place in your photoshop project and create something amazing with it all right here is it this is very very simple anyway uh, anytime that i want to download a stock image i always go to my browser and type for www.google.com so here on google search bar is where i type the name of the stock i'm looking for so what you should understand is for background background images i always download them as png but for overlays that i always apply on my image to spice it, uh, to spice it up like the beds like the leaves i always go for png so if i want to download background i always type background background download and then google will give me uh result of uh backgrounds and then i will toggle to the image results so that i can only see result based on the image because i'm going to download image so here i will scroll and find the background image that will fit the project i'm working on but if i want to be specific i may be like uh beach background download and then it will give me strictly beach images result or i can be like uh studio background download and then i'll be having studio background images then here i will scroll until i find a specific image that will work on the project i'm working on but something you should also understand is the first image uh, image that we, you will click let's say for example uh uh let's say for example we select uh this kind of studio image so if we open it like this if you go to see more google will be suggesting you image based on this kind of studio background image likewise if you go back and select let's say for example we select uh this kind of studio look so if you move to see more google will be suggesting us this kind of studio look of an image studio background image and then uh I will scroll and see which of the result, uh, which of the image I can see in the result that will uh, that will work for me on the project I'm working on. And then for uh, PNG, uh, what I do is let's say for example I want to download a bed. Let's say uh, I want to download bed uh, bed that doesn't have background. I'll be like bed PNG download and then i search so as you can see google will give me images of bed that doesn't have background or i can be specific and be like uh parrot png download and then google will give me parrots that doesn't have background something that i can just download and apply on my project without happen to waste my time and remove it background or something of that and something that you always need to understand or oh, this is something that people often make mistake people usually just right click and then save the image no it doesn't work like that what you need to do is navigate until you see the kind of uh image that will fit your project let's say for example this is okay i will first open it and then i go to visit and then now Google will take me to the website of, uh, to the uh, original website where the image, uh, uh, where this image comes from, and then I will scroll down, and then I go for download, and then maybe just minimize some ads because the images are being given for you as free, so you are going to encounter some ads, adverts on your screen. 
we just have uh, need to minimize and then here we are we successfully downloaded it and then you go to our download folder as you can see here is our power root without background on it so basically that's what i do to uh, navigate or oh, let's go back and check for the backgrounds also i mean the jpg i always i also do the same thing uh for the background let's say for example i want to download this uh uh let's say for example i want to download all right let's see i want to download this image i will just select it also and then i go to visit and then google will take me to the original website where the image come from and then i navigate oops I'm not having it so sometimes you get to try and navigate to uh to a certain image but you unfortunately find out either the image is no longer available on the website or something like that i'm not really sure so you just need to come back and look for an alternative option so let's say for example this one and then we go to visit website all right here we are as you can see all right here is our download if i'm not mistaken and then here we are we downloaded it and then we go to show finder and then here is our image downloaded as you can see so it's just something that you need to take your time navigate and always uh, always remember don't download your image right here from your google result click on the image and then visit to the original website where the image come from be it png or j uh be it uh jpg or png don't always download from the image result uh from the google result always navigate and visit the original website where the image come from and then uh, something very important you should know is you don't always get what you want for free you may find a particular stock but the site may require subscription before you can download from their platform and there are also sites that can allow you to download a limited number of stocks per day for free and also there are sites which uh which uh, which can allow you to download unlimited free stocks every day so that's it for this video if you enjoyed the video please don't forget to like share and leave a thumbs up as it makes a huge difference in supporting the channel let's see in another video